Merry Christmas. <coughs> no, no. Told you, I'm not wearing it. I'm not wearing it. Merry Christmas and welcome to the betting slip. <coughs> Brought to you by freebets.org.uk. Winner of the week is a punter who won big on the Colossus bets, pocketing £6,600 from a £2 stake in this weekend's Saturday 3pm games. That will definitely go towards some pretty nice Christmas presents this year. There's two rounds of Premier League action over the festive period. On Boxing Day, Man United take on Newcastle at Old Trafford. Now we've started scoring some goals, Falcao is 9-2 first goal scorer. The other first goal scorer odds are right there. And on Sunday in the second round of fixtures, pick of the day is Arsenal against West Ham. A battle for fourth, would you believe? West Ham are 14-5 to continue their good run of form. Andy Carroll is 13-2 first goal scorer, having scored his first goal not from his head in over a year in last week's win against Leicester. So much for the West Ham way, Andy. In horse racing, it's the King George VI chase at Kempton on Boxing Day. Silvini Arco Conti is 5-2 favourite to defend his title from last year. The odds on the other runners are right there. I'll just uh, get out of the way so you can read them. And what will you be watching on Christmas Day? The bookies reckon it'll be Mrs. Brown's Boys, which is 7-2 favourite to be the most watched TV show on December the 25th. The Queen's Speech is 14-1, to and bookies have actually stopped taking bets on whether the Queen will abdicate during this year's speech. That'll get the ratings up. Moment of the week comes from the T20 Big Bash Down Under, where Iron Morgan Eon Morgan, Ion. the New England One Day captain, did this amazing shot to help the Sydney Thunder beat the Brisbane Heat. The odds on the Big Bash winners are on your screen now. Fail of the week goes to an unlikely recipient, Cristiano Ronaldo, who unveiled a statue of himself in his hometown of Madeira in Portugal this week. It looks terrible. It looks more like Joe Hart. And Vine of the week goes to Jeremy Menez, the AC Milan forward, who scored this ridiculous goal, even though it was disallowed for offside. Scientists are still trying to work out how he did it. Fine, fine, okay, but only because it's Christmas. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to go to freebets.org.uk for all the latest tips and odds. <coughs> and comment below with all your winning betting slips. Have a very Merry Christmas, and we'll see you soon. Goodbye. <laughs>